Hello everyone and welcome to Tune In Tuesdays on Tuesday 22nd of June 2021. Today is Windrush Day, so what does Windrush mean? Windrush is related to the people who emigrated from the Caribbean to the United Kingdom in the period between 1948 and 1971. Why is it called Windrush? Many of those affected had been born British subjects and had arrived in the UK before 1973, particularly from Caribbean countries, as members of the Windrush generation so named after the Empire Windrush ship that brought one of the first groups of West Indian migrants to the UK in 1948. So, with that in mind, and the focus being on gratitude and the deck I'll be using today is the Archangel Oracle Cards deck. Let's choose a card and see. Overcoming difficulties. Archangel Jeremiah, the worst is now behind you and you are surmounting any previous challenges. The challenges you faced have made you stronger and have taught you new lessons. Instead of becoming bitter, you've opened your heart with compassion towards people in similar situations. You've let go of any blame or feelings of victimhood. This is why you're now overcoming your previous challenges. Your positive outlook is attracting a loving solution and new situations at a higher level of spiritual understanding. Stay positive. Working with Archangel Jeremiah. Jeremiah's name means mercy of God and when you call upon him, Jeremiah delivers mercy to you and everyone involved. Jeremiah guides you and others to act in loving ways. He also helps you adopt a merciful outlook, which enables you to consistently treat yourself with respect and tender, loving care. Overcoming difficulties. Given that today is Windrush Day, in recognition of those including my parents, of which I've got eternal thanks and praises among many, many others who are part of this category, can you imagine the difficulties that they have overcome and people since are actually experiencing? In accordance to this card, you've gone through that, you've gone through the worst, you're at the other side and as a result of that, you now have full life experiences that you can actually overcome the difficulties that fall in your path. Think in terms of actually being in their shoes, being in a position where in some cases it was hostile to come to this country, the UK, and to do your trade despite the fact that you were invited. But either way, okay, there's no getting over the fact that these problems still do exist, but it is getting better. So all we can do is give thanks and praises to the fact of the sacrifices that they made for us to live the lifestyles that we lead today. If you think of the trades that came towards the NHS, building, science, everything, everybody was affected. So therefore, I'll leave you with a thought of the day. Gratitude is the healthiest of all human emotions. The more you express gratitude for what you have, the more likely you will have been able to have more gratitude to be expressed for. Please hold that thought. Leave a comment, give thanks and praises and eternal gratitude. Take care.